hello and welcome back to my cheat engine tutorial series so at this point we have successfully completed the normal tutorial and now we can finally take a look at the tutorial games so what these are is there are a couple little games that cheat engine has built in where they each have a slightly different challenge so for this one here every five shots we have to reload and as soon as we start to reload it will heal so just click on it shoot five bullets none of them do anything you can shoot them slow looks like just enough but as soon as we start reloading he heals so first thing we need to do is attach to our game uh, yeah it doesn't matter and then so ammo needed till reload so we need to find that value and keep it statics or freeze it or not the instruction so it doesn't lower it or do anything we can so that we don't need to reload and we can just kill them. So let's start by doing the most basic thing we can, and that's search for five. Shoot. Search for four. And we have nothing. Okay, so we know it's not storing it as a four byte. Let's search for a float. Whoops. Search for a float of three. Search for a float of two float of one and we have nothing again so it's not search it's stored as a four byte or a float um, you can do a search for all let's just give that a shot five okay thought I clicked that there we go so we have three we have two and we're still getting nothing so Another trick is instead of them keeping track of how many bullets you have left, they'll keep track of how many bullets you have shot. So you can sometimes just invert your search and hopefully find what you want. So right now we've shot zero bullets. Let's go back to four byte because it's just a solid number. We can't shoot half a bullet. Search for zero, shoot one. Now we can search for a one. Shoot again. Now we can search for a two, three, four, five. And once it hits five, it resets to zero because it starts reloading. So we know that's our address. So we have a couple options here. We can do the easy method, which is just give ourselves infinite ammo. He'll never heal. But this problem with that is you'll every time you restart the game or restart this level you have to find your value again your address which we don't want to do right if you're making a cheat table you want it to work every time anyone loads the game so what we're going to do is we'll unfreeze it find out what writes to it attach the debugger and you can oh there you go you can shoot oh one second okay so it looks when you reload it Oh, that should have worked. Now I'm confused. Find out what writes to this address. Oh, there we go. Okay. So this will be when we add to it, and this will be where it just resets it. So all we want to do is we can hit show and disassembler. And here it is. You can replace that with code that does nothing. And you can see we have infinite ammo. But again, we would still normally have to find this instruction every time we restart the game. But what you can do as in the previous tutorials, is go down to your auto assemble, create an AOB injection template, leave all that default, and when it's deactivated, it'll run like normal, and when it's activated, all we need to do is comment out that one line. So as soon as we activate this, this hack, our health won't go down anymore. So let's test it by adding to our cheat table. goes down goes down we activate it and now we have infinite ammo so we don't need to keep that address anymore you can hold control and enter to rename these easy you can double click that or right click on it and it's somewhere in there so we'll just call this uh, level step one infinite ammo and for this one, we're stuck at three right now, but it's just because we haven't, that's where we were at when we knocked out the code. So let's go ahead and kill the target. 
and we're on to the next step.